What's going on guys? Jonathan here with TLD with some not so good news for some of you MacBook Air owners. If you watched my video yesterday on how fast the new MacBook Airs are for 2011, you'll notice uh, for the read write speeds I got some pretty impressive numbers. For the write speeds I got about 250 megabytes per second uh, and for the read speeds I got about 270 megabytes per second. So that was the 11 inch model. Uh, this is the 13 inch model that you guys are witnessing right now. So go ahead and run this test and see if anything looks funky or off. So. Right off the bat, you can see that is significantly slower. Let's see where it caps off at. 157, 159 megabytes per second. So that's nearly 100 megabytes uh, per second slower. And for the read speeds, cap out at 208, that's about, what, 62 megabytes per second slower. So that is a huge difference. I did some research and found out there's actually two different SSD models that Apple's thrown in these MacBook Airs. So I'm gonna show you guys how to make sure which SSD you got. So we're gonna have to about this Mac tab. Uh, more info and this looks a little bit different because we are in line right here so we're gonna head down to system report this will bring us back to the more familiar screen uh, and head down to serial ATA and from here that's gonna show us the model number so right here Apple SSD TS 128 C that is the slower Toshiba model that's the one from the test you guys just saw right now now on the other 11 inch MacBook Air that I tested that model is the SM 128 C that is the faster Samsung model with the read speed is about 250 uh, 270 so I just wanted to make this video to let you guys know if you did pick up a new MacBook Air if you could please check out which model number you have let me know in a comment down below uh, to see if this is consistent with the 13 inch models or it is on both the 11 and 13 inch models from what I've seen so far uh, most of the 11 inch models have uh, the better faster SSD from Samsung and most of the 13 inch models seems to have the slower Toshiba model so if you guys enjoyed this video if you found it helpful make sure to please tweet this out so it helps others that link is down below feel free to subscribe if you're new to watching and I will catch you guys later